Hello there, my name is Emma and in today's video I will be translating the Inzima francophone song Godiba by Mewe. <laughs> Hello, so I have my laptop here. I will be listening to the song from my laptop and I'll also display the video right here so you can follow as well. So let me just shift so you can follow from this angle, right? Let's get right into Godiba. <laughs> Okay, so the first or the introduction, they are saying that it is French. They are saying that vis-a-vis -vis, kawu, which means face to face, you are drunk. And then the person is saying that je ne suis pas soule, which means I am not drunk. And so the French part of this song, I was assisted by a francophone person. And so if I translate the French and I'm saying something wrong, do well to correct me in the comment section. I'm not very fluent in French. I was assisted by a francophone person. All right, so let's continue. Okay, so the first line, he's saying that Basam Ayoni Ivindi, which means the Basam trumpet is out. If you want to say something is out in Enzima, you say Ivindi. Um, so if you want to say maybe my mother has gone out, me mommy even day, me papa even day, me dear ma, me dear ma means my sibling, me dear ma even day, me go, me go means my friend, me go even day, right? But if you want to describe yourself, that means, you know, I am out, you say me, me even day, me even day. But if you want to describe something else, you say even day, right? So here he's describing the trumpet, the Bassam trumpet. So he's saying that the Bassam trumpet is out. Bassam Ayone even day. Okay, so that is the first line. Okay, so Abidjan Godeba be klonza nuleo. So Abidjan Godeba means Abidjan men, right? Abidjan men um, be klonza nuleo. That means they love to drink. And in za, in enzima, it's like a three person saying in za, right? So in za or in za means a drink, but it's used to describe alcoholic drink. So, Beklo in Zanuleo, they love to drink alcohol, right? So, Abidjan men, Abidjan men, they love to drink alcohol, right? So, that is the beginning of the song. is clearly French and what I was taught was that um, Vende bottle de code, Ventra bottle de code, Vencat bottle de code, which means two bottles for decoration, three bottles for decoration, four bottles decoration. And the person on the floor is saying that Je ne suis pas soule, which means I am not drunk, right? So that is French. If I'm not saying something right, do correct me. The francophone people do correct me, but that is what I believe he said. So we have here bibelon acolise, which means um, even the baby's bottle is filled with alcohol, right? So he's describing how you know Abidjan men love to drink. And they would buy like two bottles, three bottles, four bottles, and even fill the baby's bottle with alcohol. Do you understand? Yes, so that is what he's saying. But then they are still going to say, Je ne suis pas chili. That means they can take in this much alcohol, but they'll still tell you they are not drunk. Okay, so I'm just trying to explain the context. <laughs> Okay, 
I wake up in the morning, I have no worries. I just want to drink. I'm drinking to get drunk. Being a drunkard will be the end of me. Me just no more. In Ezima, if you want to say morning, morning is no more. Afternoon is a razzle and evening is nosle, right? So that is how we say morning, afternoon, and evening. If you want to say morning, it's wulomo. Afternoon, a razzle. A razzle means area, naso, right? <laughs> if you want to describe it in chi, which means the sun is out, a razzle. And evening is nozo, right? That means the moon is out. All right, so let's continue. <laughs> So here he's mentioning different names, right? And he's basically saying that they have, you know, harmed him in some way or the other. So I'll mention all the names, say the things that he said, and then I'll translate it to you. So he's saying that Mele to Magbase, which means Meli, you have spiritually poisoned me. Chantel to Matue, Chantel, you have killed me. Awube to Magbase, Awube, you have spiritually poisoned me. Doti to Matue. Dorothy, you have killed me. Then we have Lago to Matue, which means my girlfriend, you have killed me. And Blake to Magbase, um, which also means to spiritually poison me. Ayaga to Matue, Ayaga, you have killed me. Aku to Magbase, Aku, you have spiritually poisoned me. And Gati Ye Ye, which means spelled Ye Ye. Okay, so here I am trying to understand the context. Of this song of this part I guess it means that the people he surrounded him the people he has surrounded himself with are you know not helping him right they are even making him drink more alcohol all right so yeah let's continue <laughs> which means i wake up in the morning um i have nothing that bothers me i just want to drink um drink and get drunk being a drunkard would be the end of me right So this part is just like what I just translated. He's mentioned the different um, different people or different ladies and saying that, you know, you have poisoned me, you have killed me, you've spiritually done me something and all of that, yeah. So this part, he's talking to drunkards and he's saying that Konumza Eduardwa in Zanu le de 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 be bayewo, right? Which means drunkard, if you continue to follow alcohol or if you continue to get drunk, you know, something would happen to you. That means something bad. De be could mean anything, but in this context, it means something bad is going to happen to you. So um Konumza. Edward Wanzano le de 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 be by your wall, right? Which means drunkard, if you follow alcohol, you know, too much, something is going to happen to you. And the next line he's saying that Konumza de Chinzano le nenya hun sesebe, which means drunkard, stop drinking alcohol and gain back your strength. Um ahun sesebe means strength, right? In Enzima, ahun sesebe means strength. So drunkard, you know, um dechi de chi. So, which means stop drinking alcohol and gain back your strength, right? So, I think that's what he's saying, and I think he means that if you continue to drink or if you continue to follow alcohol, you probably go mad. 
and that's konumza walun konumza walunza nudede which means drunk that you have drunk too much right or you have you know you've consumed too much alcohol right and then the person on the floor is saying that je ne suis pas soulé, which means i am not drunk <laughs> So here you can hear that he's mentioning some names and I think those are the names of alcoholic drinks and you can hear Kutuku, UBU, Aki, Aki Soladem, um, Japalo, you know, he didn't add a quotation. <laughs> or Pito, because they like that too. Okay, so um, from here going is going to be more of the French, and I didn't get all the French translation, and so I'll probably stop here. And so I'll probably stop here, but that is what we have so far. If you continue to listen to the song, you realize that he's going to continue mentioning, you know. Um, which I've already translated, which means uh, drunkards should stop consuming so much alcohol. Um, but so far, this is the translation for Godeba. Um, it has been really requested, and I hope that I've been able to translate your favorite song. I mean, you've been listening to Godeba, but you probably never knew the meaning of Godeba. It's a song for drunkards <laughs> it's actually a song for drunkards it's a way to educate and um, people who get drunk all the time to minimize their drinking habits and to, you know to turn a new leaf and all of that and so yeah got about that you listen to is about you know alcohol so i hope i've been able to translate the song to your satisfaction if you you know want me if you have any video requests do want to leave it in the comment section below and if you have any questions you can send me an email or you can leave it in the comment section below thank you so much for watching my video to the end and have a nice day goodbye